And we're here on site with uh, Wahab from River Mist, who's one of our uh, landscape installers for Ottomore. Uh, Wahab, tell us a little bit how you installed it in this property and uh, how did you lay the wire and stuff to make this, uh, make this puppy work? Yeah, so uh, this morning we came in uh, with uh, Yarman Tech and also Ascaverna. Uh, we are installing Ottomore. Uh, we did all the, um, the wiring, the boundary, starting from the station going all around all around the yard coming back up and connecting back to the station and also installing a guide guide wire as well so that way the automower can come back when uh, when it needs to charge okay yeah so what's it doing right now is it charging right now, ready charging. to go uh, okay soon it should be able to start but uh, probably Few minutes of charging okay few i saw it going around earlier so it's probably in need of some juice yeah and yeah. Uh, i noticed there's some intricate spots so over here you got you got a bit oh. of a hill oh yeah yeah it's uh, that was a little bit uh challenging over here yeah going but the autumn work can handle it no yes. problem oh yeah it can go to the steep it can go down with the angles so that way it doesn't tilt yeah and you yeah. buried wires around and under yeah, the stones yeah, yeah around the stones there oh far nice. away from so it doesn't bump the, the rocks there yeah we were like a, a foot away from the rocks because the boundary wire gonna go all around here and cut this whole property evenly for the as long as it needs to be cut oh there we go. It's gonna follow the guide wire to the left. And it's gonna go home for some nap time. Oh yeah. That's pretty steep. So it adjusts itself to go sideways instead of up and down. So it, it because it know it's tilted. Coming downhill adjusts his motor. 